Doria Raglan's arrest rumors make the news every once in a while. And recently, the mother-in-law of Duke Sussex has been in the news because of Harry and Meghan's new documentary. Apart from this, Harry has revealed something about Raglan's past life. So what is it, and is it true that she got in trouble with the law? Join us on Royal Stories as we discuss more on this. The American social worker used to do makeup and teach yoga before she became a social worker. She's also the mother of actress and Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle. Raglan is in the news right now because of Harry and Meghan's documentary on Netflix. So, were the arrests and charges against Doria Raglan true? Was she in jail? There have been rumors that Doria Raglan was arrested and put in jail for four to five years for not paying enough taxes on the travel agency she ran. People think that this explains why she wasn't in Meghan's life for a lot of her childhood. But there are other reasons why Meghan went to live with her dad, like the fact that he lived in a better neighborhood and Doria was too busy working as a flight attendant. There are different points of view. Some say she was sent to jail, while others say that these are just untrue rumors. Since there isn't any public information about her, like a record of her crimes, it would be wrong to assume anything. Where is the American social worker now? Doria Lois Raglan was born to Jeanette Arnold and Alvin Azell Raglan in Cleveland, Ohio in the United States. Her mother, Jeanette, was a nurse and her father, Alvin, was an antiques dealer, Jeanette's second husband. When Doria was a baby, they moved to Los Angeles, and they later got a divorce. Alvin married kindergarten teacher Ava Burrow in 1983, and she was about the same age as his daughter. In December 1979, Doria married lighting director Thomas Markle Sr. They had a daughter, Meghan Markle, in 1981, and when they broke up, Meghan was only two. Doria Raglan, who is 66 years old, has worked as a social worker at a mental health services clinic in Culver City since 2015. She's worked as a makeup artist, an air hostess, a yoga teacher, a secretary, the CFO and CEO of Loving Kindness Senior Care Management, a company that runs care homes in Beverly Hills. Raglan has a bachelor's degree in psychology and a master's degree in social work from the University of Southern California. She lives in the View Park, Windsor Hills neighborhood of Los Angeles, which is two hours south of Montecito, Santa Barbara, where her daughter and son-in-law live. Raglan lives in a house that her father left to her, and she's close to Megan and goes to public events with her. Megan and Harry's children, Archie Mountbatten Windsor and Lily Bat Mountbatten Windsor, made her a grandmother. Raglan, who is 66 and prefers to stay out of the public eye most of the time, is in the documentary about Harry and Megan. Even though we have heard many of the stories before, it's still interesting to see Prince Harry and Meghan Markle speak directly to the camera in the documentary series Harry and Meghan that is available on Netflix. But there are two people in the documentary whose perspectives are completely original, and they're both Meghan's relatives. Doria Raglan, Meghan's mother, discusses the challenges that the family has faced over the past five years. Ashley Hale, who is Meghan's niece as well as the biological daughter of Meghan's half-sister, Samantha Markle, is the second new voice. Together, their contributions to the series directed by Liz Garbus provided crucial insight into how Meghan and her father, Thomas Markle's relationship, got so strained in the lead-up to the royal wedding in 2018. Raglan discussed her close friendship with Meghan as well as how she felt when she found out about Harry for the first time. Raglan reveals in the second episode of the show what it was like for her to raise Meghan as a single mother after she and Thomas divorced when their daughter was only two years old. In one of the scenes, Raglan talks to Meghan about a memory while they're driving by the location of their previous residence. And that brings us to the end of this video. Feel free to let us know about what you think about this video. And if you like this video, then please leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content.